Alright everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Misfortune in the mid lane running Harvest, Cheap Shot, Eyeball, Ultimate, Absolute Focus, and Gathering Storm. We're trying to go for max damage, lethality, Misfortune all. Just wipe out a whole team with one button. She's one of the easiest ADCs to play. And she's one of the strongest, I'd say. She's pretty good throughout the whole game because she has good early damage. And then later on, mid and late game, you just rely on your ult, which in team fights could change the whole game. So we're gonna be going a Ghost Blade as our mythic. Ghost Blade into Collector into third item could potentially be an Armor Pen item or a Bloodthirster because that gives a lot of damage. But there's three things that are gonna increase my alt damage. And that is AD, Lethality, and Crit. Against the Zoe who's trying to get really aggressive already. I didn't take cleanse into a Zoe because she's actually like the only CC on the team that cleanse would be good verse. And if she's not good, then the cleanse would just be a wasted summoner spell. She's shoving me into turret. But if I try and walk up to her, she's gonna sleep me. If I get these Q bounces, it takes a beating. I also started with a call, so I'm pretty weak. But it's a good payoff, because I get all the money back from it after 100 minions. And I get to keep the item, which gives like 7 AD. They've got somewhat of a tanky team. Ooh, the Braum ult, or the Braum shield's actually going to be annoying with my ult. He can block it. She sleeps now. I can actually just try and run her down here. Briar might be able to get her. Oh. I feel like Briar misplayed there. I'm not 100% on that, though. I'll take it. Blue buff transfer. She doesn't have TP. This is Zoe does a lot of damage. The jungler Scion? I should be fine. So we want to auto a different minion each time. You can auto one minion and go back to another one after, but... What it does is it lowers the cooldown of your W, and it also reapplies your passive. Neat. Um, I mean, I can wait for the 40 gold to get some lethality right away. Or I could buy two swords and a boot. And she does push kind of fast, but I only need to wait for 20 gold so we can get it. I just won't have any uh, potions, which will suck. But Zoe's not too hard to hit with my ult, because if she ults in, I know exactly where she's going to reappear. So she might get stuck in it. Gwen's good versus tanks if she doesn't get run over too hard early. She has ignite. She's going to want to use that on me. Before it runs out, at least. She's just trying to ignite me. I mean, it's so much free damage, I don't want to let her use it. That not bounce to her. I mean, I don't think that was worth for her to get that ignite off. I'll take it. I didn't want to have to flash to kill her, but I don't think I was going to be able to reach her. But it's worth early kills to make the late game a lot easier for us. I might ult this wave. If I can get this plating. Oh, I didn't even get the cannon. I needed to clear that wave though, or I wouldn't get any of them. Because I need a base. Well, it's not too long of a cooldown. Braum flashed. Zoe could roam here. Swords and boots. Once I have Ghostblade, I can run around the map too. 
Yeah, I get huge power spike at Ghost Blade. Even I have huge power spike now just having some lethality. But once I have Ghost Blade Collector, my ult becomes massive damage. I think Bloodthirster third is probably going to be best. Just because if I do get hit by her, I'll have sustain. I couldn't get the bounce, but I might still even get her. Just because she's so aggressive. Oh, she's getting a game. If I stand on top of him, it's pretty hard for him to land a Q, but he's just not using it. There we go. Is he a phase rush? Yeah, I'm just all inning the Zoe before she has the chance to just poke me down by landing using Qs. I figured out what she's trying to do, and I'm not letting it work for her. I would help her. I think they know. I'll stay. I have ult. I only have enough mana for like one spell though, but I could get a big ult here. Oh. No. He's alive. My ult's not gonna kill anyone if they're all full HP. There are lots of bad guys. Good thing I got a lot of bullets. I might just ult to clear this wave. I think Zoe's still down there. If they do dragon, there they are. I mean, they actually did that pretty quick. I wonder if Sign was punching it or it just never reset. I mean, I made Zoe just lose a lot of farm and I got a plating. And I got Ghost Blade, so even without boots, I'm pretty fast because Ghost Blade gives you movement speed on a combat, and so does uh, Misfortune W passive. 65 from this, 40 from this. So I have 428 move speed without boots. I'm faster than her by like 50 move speed. 100 move speed faster than her with boots. I mean, you can't do that to me, Zoe. Ooh. If she doesn't hit that bubble, I know that's all she has. So if she misses that, I'm just going to chase her. So much mana I use, though. I do not have any mana with this build, but later on, I'm only going to need, like, two spells to kill someone. Alright, I really need Scion not to gank me here or I could die. I might just have to ult the wave again. I mean, if I use my Qs to farm this wave, I'm going to have no mana left. I could just use autos and try and pick her. Oh my god, look at that damage. I'll get closer to her so when she cues me, if she did decide to cue me, I would be close enough to hit her back. Plus, the closer to her I get, the less damage I take from her cue. That was a good ult, though. If she didn't have a ghost there off the ground, she would have died, I think. Cause unless she still has her flash. I don't know if that's up or not. Alright, I don't have mana. I could go for this, but we don't know where Scion is. <laughs> and Zoe's on her way back to lane. I got three minions left on call. I think I'm going to go attack speed shoes over cooldown boots. Cooldown boots are going to make me burn through my mana faster. It'd be nice to have ult and flash and barrier up a little bit faster, but I mean, Zoe's going to use my sums against me if they're up more. And then also... Oh, that was close. I'm going to run out of mana faster with more spells being used. So I'll just go the attack speed helps me clear the wave faster without burning mana. Plus my auto attacks do hurt with this build. We can get her. I would keep chasing but she's going to Scion. 
I needed Briar just to turn, but maybe she was just going to ignite Briar and kill her. She has no dash. I think I can try an alter here. If anything, she'll have to flash out. Got her. I know Zoe actually has very low mobility if her R is down. And she has no flash. I don't know where Scion is. More plating for me. Alright, we're gonna go Collector next. Okay, I mean, look at this. I'm two levels ahead of Zoe. She went Armor Boots, which is pretty smart for her. She'll take less damage. Oh, what the... I mean, she can't really pick up these flashes unless she R's in. But, like, why? I'm so confused. Yeah. See, she, she had to use a flash to get away. I could flash on her and kill her here, but I don't think it's worth it. If Garen flash ults me, I'm gonna die. If he flash Q ults. Nice. A little risky. I might ult the wave though, just to clear it. Teammates kind of need to stand in front, though. I did solid damage to Garen. Got ult upgrade. Next time you see me, be friends. What's your agon? Cloud's nice on me since I'm already pretty fast. It's Sarah Fortune. We don't really have jungle pressure, though. Probably going to need an LDR over a grudge. Integrating new hardware. I mean, I could potentially take someone out of the fight. The thing is, if Zoe hits a bubble on someone, it's going to be so hard to get anything. Exo, how's my night look? Your nightly schedule includes flirting, followed by extreme violence. Man's bot. Oops, my fingers slipped. I don't want to fight in the river because that gives Zoe an opportunity to land a bubble on me. I'm going to try and poke her before she gets there. Okay, that's her real flash. Look how much damage I'm doing to Kate. I almost hit Zoe with that too. Really. Not bad, got the dragon. I mean, my team did good there taking out Scion. Oh, Caitlyn got away. I mean, I hit Caitlyn like twice and she folded. She got deleted. Collector is very close. I need a hundred gold. See, most people would sell this, but I'm gonna wait and just farm a camp because it's 7 AD. Lose 7 AD for an item that I could just farm. I mean, I could even wait the 20 gold. I'm just gonna farm a wave though. I mean, the only reason that would be good to sell here is if I killed her just because of the collector at this fight. She's pretty terrified of me, I'd say. There's clear wave. Now I go get collector. Um, Edge of Night would be very good too, so I don't get CC'd while I'm alting. I may build it if they keep canceling my ult. But that isn't for max damage, but 
no point in going max damage if we can't even get the ult off. Yeah, Garen hasn't died yet. Neither has Kate. Traded HP. She did a lot of damage there, actually. But if she does that again, I'm gonna alter. I know she doesn't have flash. I think Caitlyn flashed away from me too. He actually didn't take any damage there. He doesn't even have armor boots. Oh, this is gonna be really rough with the Braum. The Braum actually counters me really hard. He won't be in every fight though. We'll find an opening. I think we save up for EF sword. I could even go the uh, LDR next. I mean, they're already pretty tanky. We'll see. Oh, my collector got him. Wow, I'm so lucky he didn't hit his, uh... Oh. So lucky he didn't get to army, or maybe he did. Who knows? Get a good luck. Next time I'm surprised Zoe didn't catch up to me by stealing my flash. Come on, Gwen. I don't think Gwen wins this. Oh, my God. Gwen, what's wrong? <laughs> okay, it worked somehow. She's dead. Just leave her. Yeah, that Garen and Cyan are actually really scary. Ooh, Fire Soul though. That's really good for me. Yeah, three of them don't take damage. I have to go with the LDR. I like going grudge because of the slow. I could hit more of my ult bullets, but I definitely need the LDR. Half the fun is letting them know you're out there. Our junglers are really far behind. Okay, let's kind of get this shit this back because we don't actually. Oh god. Why, dude? Like, there's no reason for her to even alt there. Maybe I can catch the back line. Goes wrong, literally countering everything. We're good still. It's always killable. Fast enough to dodge that. Now we gotta deal with Garen. That's good. I killed her, but I'm sleeping. Okay, and Gwen's splitting, and I got blue, so I have mana. Where's Kate? Briar's running it down. Kate's there. Briar just needs to chill, man. I mean, somebody has to go top. Rom's up there.
Mm, how much do I need? To watch me leave. I may as well base now. I don't know when I'll be able to base. More guns, more glory. Updating plugins. Shoot first, and there are no questions later. Really, it doesn't matter who dies, unless it's Garen and Sion. She's so low. She's gonna get slowed. Dude, he even blocks the twin. <laughs> He's going thorn mail. Oh, we're getting dragon. Nice. I mean, we could fight. I mean, I would rather not. No, we can't fight. Was that my damage there? I don't think I was like the only one hitting them that much. But I mean, Gwen doesn't have any damage here. Well, maybe it was me and Ez. Integrating new hardware. Mm, that's the stuff. I've got more firepower than I need to do with. Pull up that tree. Quiet. Now, okay, still needs a mythic. All right, well, I was doing a lot of damage there to those tanks. I see you. Let's tear this place apart. I don't think they're doing it. The Caitlyn still hasn't died. She's just going a uh, lethality alt build, which isn't as good anymore. But she's really not doing anything in these fights. She's, she's. Uh, too scared of dying, so she even though she's five and zero, oh, she's not doing anything at all. I mean, we could do this. Yeah, let's burn it, I guess. This is kind of risky, though. I think they might all be going bot for Glenn, though. Garen, they don't know. We're good. Yeah, that fight down here actually turned out to be really well. At first, I wasn't able to reach them. Oh, I got rank 3 alt. At first, I wasn't even able to reach them or do anything, but then I started getting some autos and cues on them all. I think I just run her down. Four hits. If she misses the bubble, that's all she has. Reminder, the eye is the window to the brainstem. I want to go buy my armor pen really quick. Definitely going to go with LDR. It gives more damage versus tanks. I don't have the slow, but it's whatever. 22% bonus damage against them is going to be insane. And this item, the crit, actually gives me more damage on the alt, too. I can probably like insta kill Kate and stuff, but if Brom's around, I think they saw me because Garen started running this way. I mean, I should do pretty solid damage to Garen now. Oh, I got Zoe and Kate first. I think we win the fight though. I took out so much of the tanks. The science Friar's gonna die. Right into the trap. I mean, they, they literally used everything for me there. I couldn't have played that better. Oh my god, what are you doing? Just leave, please. Oh, now he's dead. I got Garen flashed on, who has. Phase Rush Stride Breaker. I even got away from him. 
But then I got hit by Zoe and Kate over the wall. It's fine. At least we don't lose anything. Now running violent revenge protocols. Okay, I should have good damage for Simon and Garen now. Really need someone not to die right before the dragon fight here. Gwen's pretty safe. Garen's top. Free drag. No Garen. They can only steal. We still have Baron. We don't have Ez, but it's fine. Garen's like way more valuable to their team. Oh my god, look how much damage he's taking. Ah, can see it all. Holy shit. I knew I had to go in there. Because if we run... They're just gonna get control of the fight. Do we have the objective on? No, they do, right? Why does it have a thing on it? <laughs> nice day for some payback. Briar just needs to understand she's not the carry. She shouldn't keep building damage. If she got a cleaver and shredded their armor even more. Which, actually, I should get a cleaver. I think I need a cleaver next. I think it would do more damage than a crit item here. And the health would be nice. More guns, more glory. My team's fighting. They should have finished me off when they had the chance. Get a good luck. 100 gold off of this. We won't be friends. When's going to get strong soon? She just needs like one or two more items. Oh my god. Did you see their HP? Kate and uh Kate and Zoe are 1 HP each. Okay, there's two tanks top. I can we can take this. There's really low. My E might even be able to kill Zoe here. Where am I not gonna go? A lot of tigers think they can me until they don't. Brom flash, that's huge. Oh, if that bounced her, it like would almost one shot her, I think. As long as Garen and Scion are still top and Briar's splitting, I can actually just push mid here. I don't know where Scion is. But I can kill this turret if I hit it for a few seconds. Barely. No signs behind me. You can't keep a vengeful girl down. I got the turret. Cleaver, red pot. I don't think I can sell my boots. I need the move speed. I mean, I could sell it for like... Actually, I might sell it for the spell shield, but I don't know. Losing out on the move speed... I already do enough damage to kill them. I just don't want to lose my speed. Dude, 
Dude, I killed that Scion so fast. Aaron's bot, yeah, we could, uh... She's gonna die here, though. Alright, we gotta do this. We don't have time. Maokai really could just tank it. Now we can't do it, because Maokai's like, Hey. Come on, come do it. They might be able to defend that into. Why is Glenn behind him? Anyone gunning for this girl better be ready. Like five to one. Wait, how did he make it over the wall? Wait, Garen literally just disappeared. Wait, what? He was not even close enough to the wall to flash over that. I'm so confused. All right, whatever. To the Baron or Dragon. That's insane. He was not even near the wall. I don't get bubbled here. Oh, there we don't have Briar. Uh, we can't do it. I got it with our. We can just back up. We don't need to fight this one. Let me try and kill this one. Oh, Whoa! Oh my god! What? My Q just one shot two people. Oh, so close. Oh my god. Look at that cleaver damage, 6k extra damage. How much from this? 10k! 4k damage on ult on the Scion. What a game, man. I did not think my Q would do that much damage there. Well, she has no E. I just one-shot her. Literally just one-shot her with a Q. Okay. Okay, we go bot as five now. Oh, you know what? It's because we have three infernal dragons with a uh, infernal soul. It's me and my exoskeleton when... against the world. World, if you have to. I'm 24 and 1. Um, I'm gonna go with Edge of Night. Spell Shields. We need Gwen Top. Really don't want to lose to a Hallbreaker. Oh my, dude, these people are actually driving me crazy. Like, how stupid can you be? Can't even go top, and then she DPs to a fucking minion. Insane. Her whole Baron push just got wasted because of her. And now, if they get engaged on bot, I'm not there to carry the fight. And we still have nobody defending top! Dude! I, that's so tilting, man. Like, I give them one command. Like, all you gotta do is listen to one thing I say to win the game. And she has a mental breakdown because she doesn't want to take orders from the person who's only trying to win the game. What the fuck? You need to defend top, Gwen. 
I want revenge or death. Oh my god. This is such a free win. Whatever, we'll just play defense. We'll just play defense till we can get a pick. We can't play offense. I don't know why Maokai keeps hitting them away every time I'm there. He did it in the dragon pit like three times too. He just cues them away. Oh, I could have hit her right there. It's insane. Like, I can one shot them in a fight. <laughs> Got her flash, too. Dude, I do so much damage. I don't think I crit her on any of those hits, too. But I, I can walk up to Zoe now because I have Edge of Night. Well, Garen's not here. We can go fight. I don't care. Ugh, I'm just countered with the Braum. I can't just ult. That's why I hate Hallbreaker. They really need to remove Hallbreaker out of the game. Like, a losing team can just have Hallbreaker champion side lane, and there's nothing I can do. Well, we got a whole minute. We got a whole minute to go take Baron. They might rush it. I think I can ult them in the pit, though. That Garen actually died a little bit too fast. We're going to lose the inhib, though, if nobody clears that. Huh? So They're not here. You just do this. Okay, if we get Elder and Baron, I think we'll be okay, because then we have the recalls to defend. But I mean, we had Baron recall when Gwen just needed to go defend one top wave, and she couldn't do that. There are lots of bad guys. Good Ezreal's armor come. Get off my desk, Smudge, but say hi to everyone. Say hi. Okay, she said hi. I don't know what they picked up. Get down, please. Ow, ow, ow. I got ganked by a cat. I actually might have just lost it because of Smudge. Or we get the biggest alt of the game. Thanks, Smudge. Even through the Braum Shield, they just one shot three people. That should be GG. How much damage did that do? That probably was like. That was a lot of damage. Alright. Let's see if we can end this game. It doesn't matter how much armor they build. I have so much armor pen in my build. Oh my god. G. G. That was a struggle. That was actually like almost 1v5. Ezreal and Maokai did their part, but Briar and Gwen were just like... Actually insane in the hub. But if you guys enjoyed... Make sure to leave a like, also subscribe to the channel. That was actually a very fun and entertaining game, though. And leave a comment below. Give me more ideas on what I should play next. We did. 98k damage. Let's just round it up to 100k damage. Look at that damage chart, man. Physical, magic, true. Didn't do any of those. Just all physical. Damage taken. 74k. Harvest did 3,000. Cheap Shot actually ended... Wow. Cheap Shot did 2,100 damage. I think it's because it applies on red buff. And I had red buff for, like, a lot of the game. And my E. Wow, that actually did a lot of true damage. Yeah, other than that, I'll see you later. Peace.